But IEBC Chairperson Wafulechi Bukati and his team of six commissioners this morning paid a courtesy call on National Assembly Speaker Justin Muturi and his Senate counterpart Ekwe Thuro. The two speakers promised to accord the electoral body full support ahead of the August general election. IEBC CEO Ezra Chiloba was also in attendance. So engage with as many of us as possible. We may, not necessarily, you, we may not necessarily agree with what you decide to do after engage, that engagement, but you will have engaged us. So at the main event, we, don't have, we cannot have 100% um, uh, acceptance of uh, your programs. But at least when everybody knows this is what you are doing, you have already explained to yourself you want to do this because of various reasons. Whether we agree or we don't agree, you have told us. The stakes are pretty high in elections. I am a firm believer the elections in Kenya, there is no small or big election. A presidential election affects a voter. An election for maybe the lowest uh, person, the MCA, affects the same voter. So I am strongly persuaded that in the Kenyan context, holding all those elections at a go is extremely important. After counting votes, we shall announce who has won the election based on the votes we have counted. And uh, that's a decision we have to make. It's a, it's a constitutional duty which we must deliver. As the Secretariat, our commitment to ensure that uh, the commissioners